Simple's got armor behind it. Get a smoke obscured. Bit and Simple with a 1.2 rating in their first affair. First fixture here in the quarters. Let's see if they can match that. Oh, Bit, he's been spotted up. That nice elevated angle towards Ticket chips him away a little lower. Oh, yeah, he's been put down. Apex on that P2K. And JL onto Zywu. Missed that one. Lots of space here, though, for JL. Spinks trying to track him down. Position given up now. JL needs to be careful here. You can see aware of all the angles oh. as Spinks will take down Alexi. Issues now because they're heading into the site and Flames. He's going to be the first one on the scene. Good job onto the bomb carrier. So Imez gone. Flames finds charge to reload. And oh my oh. god, GL. He takes them both down on the CT side. Leaves it all onto Simple. A winnable one versus two with the bomb on the floor. Well aware of where Flames was located, but Sphinx is the question mark. Oh, information. And he's taunting, toying with their information now. Back and forth he goes, looking to isolate Jules, and with precision, simple strikes. A second required, and Spinks will provide. Defends and converts that simple clutch, and are considering how hard. Apex, the connector player, Zywu, window, but basically the Orca will be everywhere, and Magisk has this A anchor. You Check can see him highlighted AK. here. It's on JL, they're really backing him up for the impact. And Alexi B's been cut down by Zywu. Magisk, he was flashed off, but Apex will finish the job. And this is spotless, perfect, untarnished. This defense all hinging now on that simple dig. He's going to go down shortly. They're charging forwards. Magisk confirms he's on the way back. And from behind, Flames will strike clean. Five down, five alive, Vitality 2-0. Yeah, it doesn't get better than that for a second round. With window smoke deployed, him at, he's pre-firing it. Apex, yeah, he's gonna get rumbled on that one. Good awareness, I think, just off a sliver of info. And Sphinx will just take his place, he'll have another go. Does him really get two for two, or are they gonna overlook the position given there's a frag there already? No! Oh, Sphinx massacres them both, safe from the flames, and he will elope through the smoke, four on three. Needs someone to turn the tide of battle to on his plate on the A site. Magisk is on a, oh, just on a timing, looked away and dead now. JL's tied us back up at three each and it probably favors the T side here. But they're not expecting flames, he doesn't just need Oh, yeah, okay. too soon. Oh, he's so low. Bullets, flames, three HP. Simple could bang him out with one through the boards. JL, well aware he's trapped and Sphinx has caught bit as well. So this is getting really close. Sphinx again has made it awkward for Simple. As Flames just trying to survive delay, and only the one Flames does leave with the frag. And they'll leave with another round quad kill out of Sphinx. He is in top form. Be instrumental here. Back this. down to a pistols and an AK. Yeah. Facilitated simple with a rifle and with Alexi B posting a Tech 9 frag and Apex he can't swing because of the molly, so Spinks has to be the one to step up for that early frag. Oh! oh Imma hits a scorcher, and Imma's done it again! Double D from Imma! Finally down to Apex eventually, but taking his time about it and caught by him simple on the trade. Well, they know this is the A anchor. Yeah, well, they know where he is and they have him in his sights. Magis gets a new lease of life thanks to the miss of JL's dig, but the round's falling into place nonetheless. Yeah, look at how much space simple can take here. Bit just needs to rotate over and you're not too worried about the underpass play because Magis goes over towards ticket here. So that would be a regular way that this rotation could get cut off. Solution for everybody. I don't think there's many uh, Arabic speakers on the stage. Yeah, that, yes, exactly. Yeah. So I think we're safe. That would work. That would be a quick solution. He does have support. And they just go dry. Magis, big contribution. And Vitality immediately with a leg up in the round. Really lands on Emma here to be able to make something happen. Yeah, but look at the perfect placement of the crosshairs. Zaiwu eliminates the threat, extends their advantage. A deep incendiary facilitates Magis to go wide behind him. JL's oh. ready, hyper aware of the play. <laughs> you see the shake of the head there as well. Two telegraphed, he knew what was up. Yeah. All right. Like, oh, that Molly's deeper than normal. It's sort of like you're leaving space for someone. Well, they know that Zaiwu was here. Apex oh, can't be too far away. Straight through the smoke. Bit of a flames maneuver he's thrown into the mix here. JL straight into the site, lots of space. Oh, and Apex looks away. Simple has managed to level the odds a little. Alexi to plant, simple. Go to body. Oh, and he's hit the shot. Zywu racks him up and Vitality comfortable in another conversion. Now this one here, as soon as this happens, Simple left with absolutely nothing to do. That was the JL <laughs> kill on the push. A fantastic start from Spinks and Flames. 17 frags and Zywu onto Simple, okay. 
That's uh, already looking awkward. Na'Vi needs something from him, and he's got one before Apex puts him down. Two-man advantage. Now they're smooth sailing. It will draw the attention. JL staying noisy with this. There's problems here. Flames going to find him easy as you like. And now it's just one more bit. Has been able to worm his way in for a little bit of room. But Magis ready for it. Sharp. A headshot comes through. And the lead has grown 5-1 to one in favor of Team Vitality here. Another different look. This is going to be Zywoo getting boosted up. The AWP head to head. And Simple gets the better of him this time round. Yeah, they're one in each in that head-to-head -head right now. That's their third opener. We'll flash it this time. And the molly as well. Sphinx. Extinguish. Forced out of him. Trying to get away. Repositioning. Getting sprayed. Good find from Imet. Lots of damage back. Still the frags come through. Flames could do a lot of damage here, but he is all alone. Hiding. Tucked into the corner, knowing they're low and susceptible to the spray. They will get that bomb down. Keyword damage. Does he play for that here? You'd think so. Could be in his best interest with six grand as well. And Simple down, they're forcing more and more of these rebuys. Flames, a triple. On the warpath now, Jail's opted for the AWP. He's not known to be an AWP. If that nade lands and it obscures his view, he hits the shot. But still, significant damage dealt. Na'Vi get themselves their second. Oh, hey, this is just such a nuisance. Yeah, just when they think they've got a bit of room to maneuver, he strikes and that could not be a tighter gap. Saiwoo just holding more for info than frags. When you've got this advantage, it makes a lot of sense. And you know, simple, he wants to be the playmaker. Yeah, 25 seconds. What's the go? What's the idea? Is it a save? Are we giving this one a crack? Well, we need to find something. And now, when you're not going to find anything, when Zywoo's hitting shots like that. They're so good. They're so tight as well. Hoping they give you something. But they're giving you nothing. Oh, a miss on the quick scope, oh. which opens up to this the double back spray. On. It certainly is, but Magisk. Oh, down to the no scope. Simple pins him to the wall. And with a couple of seconds to spare, they have got the bomb down. This would be crazy if Bit can close. He's lost Simple. He's lost his partner in crime, but the highest rated player in their first game here at Gamers 8. Can he hit the shot? Yes, he can. And now on to Flames. He's been brilliant, but can he somehow recover? Bit with three, looking for four. And he's oh! missed the shot. Flames nails it and saves them from an incredible attempt from the 2v4. Oh, Eight on the board for Vitality. They almost pulled that one out of nowhere. The nowhere, double kill bro. towards CT spawn. The no scope from Simple to unravel the dark player. And then the 2v2 unfolds. Bit with an AWP in his hands. You don't see that every day of the week. Oh, bloody hell, that was close. Look this, at this double was great, right? You can see them just squirming. And that was after the great start. Simple, enough time to get the bomb down here. Jumping and Flames up. transcended to Flamesy in this one. Right. Whoa. It's on the other side of the map, so look I don't think we'll see it come into use. That cross up with the wall. And look, look, he's got his hand. Look, he's got, he doesn't have his hand on. He, he didn't have his hand on the mouse or the keyboard. <laughs> oh, could have a head to head, yeah. Or rather, all to Bart. Zywoo turns away. Gets simple. The feed, nice control out of Apex. He's got Mortar on his plate though, and Alexi Beast is next. Victim Vitality just topple the assault. And another one for Magisk. The A anchor is anchoring. And with nine seconds left, there's nothing for you here. Yeah, Simple just resides himself to the save, and you can see the frustration oh. he's got. He's got a lot of yep. things to say. Oh. This is timeout territory yet again here, I think. Dude, 10 2. 10 2. This is Navi's pick. If, and we have Nuke next. Gonna test Flamesy. Yeah, he looks so stressed now. We've got the camera on him a lot of the time, and and because it's late round. Oh, fine from Magisk. He's got confirmation of another towards middle as well. Sphinx is just gonna isolate him at here. And oh, Flamesy, yeah, tested. Gets himself all the time in the world to reload. As this what a scout? What's JL supposed to do? Die most likely. So he probably said. It's one. Oh, it's two. And <laughs> Flamesy will close. But fair play. JL's had a couple of cracking individual he's shots. He's had great shots so far. Pistol round, yep. eagles. It, it, the, he's had some, some really good contributions as far as aim is concerned from JL. But these two rounds that they've won, it was the one where Simple got the opening pick with the AWP on towards Zai, where that was towards B, and then they rerouted and finished A. And then the other round, and that's where Flamesy almost <laughs> stole it away. And then the other one they were able to pick up was the Immer double deagle in mid that right. I think started with, yeah. Well, we are 13 rounds in. This game's over. Yeah. Stark contrast of the emotional state. Oh. That is an uncomfortable way to go down. Now they've got info as well as to the booster. Oh, 
Zephyr trying to tap away and it gets worse for him as Magis nails it on the AK. Spinks some flames, hanging out, spraying down. Alexi B, the next victim. This is far too easy. It's comfortable. Leisurely. And flames, where are you? Where are you? What, what are you up to, my man? Well, he's just feeling it. He's Why not? He's feeling himself. Go wherever you want, mate. If that ended up in a knife 18 kill. 18 and 4. If that ended up in a knife kill, I swear we need three back-to-back -back timeouts out of Na'Vi. We probably could just concede Mirage and move on to Nuke yeah. quite quickly, couldn't we? Gosh. Maybe Emma can find one of the Magisk, and with that 4 HP, he'd be hard-pressed to plant, but he has got 60 seconds. When he gets the plant, Sphinx is there. Ooh. Ooh, it's not gone well. Good plant, though. And here's this proactive nature we've been talking about. It, bro, in. Yeah. Yeah. it hasn't been the focal point, but it's come in late. Has he got a little something to work with there? He does. Magis knows his angles, controls it beautifully, even ready for JL as Damn. Magis demonstrating his individual mechanics, putting himself at the forefront of this round. It's Magis to close as well. 13. Unlucky for some, definitely not Vitality. He has 108 ADR, Sphinx yeah. 106, 93 for Flamesy, 98 ADR for Apex. It's Zywu with only 53. <laughs> and this is the score. Oh, that's cheeky. Magisk already takes down JL. Bit gives him something to celebrate. There needs to be more out of him. Six bullets left in the clip. They're already into the A site. And not planting. They're fighting. They wanted to try and take a little extra space away from the CTs. And that CT smoke actually favors them to get the bomb down. Thank you very much. Appreciate it. We'll spam the smoke. Oh, get the bomb. Get through it. Oh, it's falling apart for them. Apex with the double up. And leaving it all onto him. Nice clicks. Great onto the first. Just about whittling it to Sphinx is 26, but it's not looking good. Still have Magisk as well. He's been waiting mid this entire time. He's hearing all of this. And yeah, eventually, feels like Magis is going to shoot him in the back of the head. Gets away from him to Sandwich. And no time for this one here. He's hitting some shots. He's taken down Sphinx. And it looks like it'll be Magis that grabs himself an extra one. So 180R across the board, pretty much. Just meaningless there, isn't it? Like, Emma giving it a crack, but it's over. There was no chance. What is he meant to do in a situation like that? You can see the post plan set up. There was absolutely no way back in. And you mentioned that smoke. The fact they get two kills through it against them and get the bomb down. It's going from bad to worse here. Simple. Looking even more dejected, and you can understand, right? It's not going well for anybody on the Na'Vi side of the server. Somebody throw in the towel, because this one is done, and it should be following the script here. Na'Vi with the force by short, but Vitality oh, with a group on. effort. Yeah, if this flash is good, it looks like it is. Bit swings through. Oh, they were all behind the wall. Mistimed on that one. Now Ima, next victim, completely blind. Spinks and Magis with a flash assist. JL, the one that wasn't flashed, does get one, but that's it. This is done. Look how many smokes are on the site right now. Another one added to the mix. That's the whole oh, squad using their smoke grenades while with the bomb down and just two for Na'Vi. 15th, just a couple more frags away. This is just an absolute mauling right This is, I mean, this is this is illegal. This is like us trying to have hand-to-hand -hand combat with a bear. Like, it yeah. was never going to go well. Yeah, go on, simple. A couple of confidence boosters ahead of that next map. And, yeah, it's going to go down to Zaiwu there. But, but me, by the way, I think Zaiwu, yeah, he is. He's had the least to do. Yeah, he hasn't he's, had to do he's anything. He's eight and seven. He's just sitting there like, yo, guys, thanks for the carry. Wait, well, hold up. Is this what it feels like? <laughs> yeah, this right. is great. Emma's got the element of surprise here, but for some reason it looks like Daiwu <laughs> knows. Daiwu knows! Oh, he thanks, Magis. <laughs> this is done. Only Alexi and Simple remain, and Vitality have made this, a, I'd call this a statement. Yeah. This is a statement of intent. Apex onto Simple, Apex re greedy onto the next one, puts Alexi on 8 HP. They're coming for you, they're not going to let you find the fight. They'll bring the fight to you, 16 to 2. Vitality. Lay claim to Na'Vi's pick, and now one away from knocking them out of the tournament. This is brutal. Yeah, pack it up, pack it in, let Nuke begin. We'll be right back. Break of the vent from Alexi on heaven. Jewel, is it just a go? Jewel is it just a go? Well, the Molly from Apex. Yeah, here it comes. Yeah, and oh, JL, actually, interesting. 
They're not going to clear this. They do. Flames versus the Jewel. He struggles to track. Makes him best of a mess of that, but still gets his frag. Pinned in. He's trapped. And his smoke's not going to be oh. simple to help. He can only spam. That was lined up. Yeah, Apex holding for that rotation of Imet as well. Great clicks out of bit. Looking good for the first two. Makes a round out of it if Simple can close. Oh, he can't. Man. It's mad just gone the triple and it's vitality right back to their winning ways. Yeah, another pistol where Simple gets left in a one on two situation. Emma yet to frag here. Zero and four. Simple on that. Oh, big green. It's too easy for Zaiwu. Takes him down. Simple caught unawares, unprepared, and yeah, this one, as you discussed, was uh, an opportunity for Na'Vi to kind of uh, just have a bit of a grasp on this map. Because at the moment, you know, it's one thing to be eliminated. Oh, and Alexi gets two with his magazine. JL can't finish off onto Magisk, and it puts Bit into a one versus three. Top side plant inbound. They're an underdog as far as the world rankings are concerned, but they're a titan of Counter-Strike, right? Na'Vi is a massive name, so you have a higher expectation for them. Bit, he's got the best weapon for the job. Sphinx being procedural on his clear, supported by Flames and Zaiwu. We hard pressed to find a lot here, and oh, only the one. Nice work onto this entrance. That was simple. Frag onto Flames and the bomb on the floor. This looks like there's something to be said about this for Na'Vi. So I realizes he's going to have to do a bit more of the heavy lifting in this one. Oh, and simple. A second from the hut position. Alexi goes wide. And Na'Vi just need to find Magisk. And they shall. It's in there to provide huge conversion. Okay, well, out of the three rounds they've won in total in this series thus far, two of them have been on lighter buys. Have really made it difficult for JL. Now the Flex that comes in. Look at this. It's so threatening. They even got flashes on top of it. JL still. Oh, goes down. Sphinx just with a hero adjustment. And Imet only the one. Nice from Alexi. Bomb Playing loose. around that T vent. The bomb is loose and he has control of it. Apex dead as well. Alexi doing everything he can. Bits already added another to the mix and it's Navi's round. Two in a row. This is better. There you go. Consecutive rounds as well. So we are running some change. Damage, Emma doing well towards the back of the site. Here's that double nade we were talking about. But I think one of the uh, greatest pieces of this is the Alexi double kill, right? The, the bomb's loose. Able to find some impact towards that squeaky door. Well, two rounds, that's not enough to get anybody excited. But if they can continue to string these together, maybe just maybe we can have a conversation here. Throwing their bodies on the line, feeding Alexi B up to nine kills now. And Simple looking even more erratic than usual in some of those little sprays. He's a high sense game up. <laughs> Perfect for you. Oh, <laughs> it's deadly. It's just frustration, isn't it? Like, uh, JL rolls on in, bang, dead, and then a dink immediately. It's like, are these guys going to miss today? Good timing on this. Yeah, they're heading into just an isolated bit here. He's got the angle. He's ahead of the flash, and oof. Yeah, he's in trouble now. Simple summoned. Perfect. Manages to pick away at the bomb carrier and bit. Connecting onto flames. Looking to make it just a one-round game. Zywoo and Magisk with Sphinx as well. This is still a very potent group of Vitality players. Could but try and turn the tables with full 60 seconds, but simply he's posted on this angle. Look at this, the reward. Wow. It's a headshot somehow. Well, he must have whipped into that yeah, one. Yeah, he did. Uh, and that'll be that. Uh, I think there was... Oh, spotted here as well. Alexi, the jig is up. You know exactly where you're at. Ability for a Galil, and then Apex can operate on something lighter. So uh, there is the ability for Vitality to have uh, another quite threatening round here. But uh, Vitality looking to hedge in here with something quite costly, and there you go. Simple onto Magisk. An opener as they're going to think the AWP is the problem they have to avoid towards Yarwell. Well, Alexi's here with JL in combination. Flames, he's gone, and there you go. Just like that. Zywe was revealed his AWP is out yard two, and he's going looking on the war path here, and... Spots out one, second chance for Bit. Molly out, he's gonna try and take these fights. He's forced JL into the Molly and actually just completely 100 to zeroes him. Imet. Uh, Imet. How, Imet. Ha! how didn't he hear no him? scope. Zywu in now in a one versus two. That is an unforgivable mistake if it translates. Takes his time. Simple posted. Zywu, what? He's gotten away. He's gotten away now, and it's bit rotating in another isolated jewel. God, it's close. Okay, well, Emma's probably the most happy about that one.
Get him across. They're going to flash through this. No one's present. Oh. This is really clunky right now. And in mid blind and executed by Flames. Sphinx has set him up for success there. Simple getting run at. Flames cut down by the simple orb. Sphinx anticipating this clear and actually good for it on the Galil. JL is going to be kicking himself now. And surely they're aware of Alexi. We saw this consistently against Fury just the other day, right? And then Zaiwu. Where is Zaiwu right now? his way around towards so he's going right. to surely so call this hell, clear man. this is yeah this is a save or an awkward retake it's just there's too many power positions given up and now it's got a towards yes yes indeed gave you a second look there didn't he bang alexi gone yeah i love this position because if they were to go up the ladder as well you're not going to be clearing behind you either now oh what does he do with this information hmm i think you could risk a fight here right he's on his way oh. Breaks his legs, Simple takes him down. Simple? Simple wants an AK-47, makes sense. He's got 11, make it 13K, and so he'll try and give himself every edge he can have. Oh, tagged up Alexi on that spam, just a little. Door open, Zaiwu versus Simple. Oh, it's not ideal. An equalizing frag. And that 20 HP doesn't really come into a factor as he switches to the Tech 9. You think maybe he's got another one. Another opportunity, but Zaiwu finds his 13th frag and it's on to Simple as well. They might opt for another save here. Alexi B coming over. They're trying to find it any way down. I think if he gets another here. He's going to get the barrel lead yeah. time. Oh, it's perfect from Zaiwu. Oh, and Flames. He'll take them both out the vents. They're left with only Alexi's M4. Apex could even have a chance on this one. Not going to be checking. So maybe Alexi leaves at least with his life. When Simple was coming down from ramp there, do you think the ramp players were close enough to hear him and then Zywu swung out like that? I'm not sure. No. Right? We, we're, we're all like, we don't get every little detail of exactly what's going on. But Zywu swung out with such conviction. He did. So they were able to deal with all the rota uh, rotation points quite considerably there. Yeah. Wow. Okay. Magis just trying again. This time straight down the vent and stack nades onto him. This is bit. It's his moment as he finds a double onto some of the hardest hitters. Alexi adds another to his tally. As Na'Vi set for a seventh hit on the CT side. However, with Flamesy and Zywu still in the mix. Ooh, yeah, lost the bomb now. Alexi B locking down Yard. I mean, he's passing the test in that sense. Well aware of the potential for a flank. One. Yeah, he had an opportunity, but a quick adjustment out of Ime. And it's actually JL and Ime right now who are kind of dragging their heels in the fragging department. I mean, they're already kind of swapping sides at this point. Yeah, you can see him trying to do this silently right now just to not give up the play. Bots him out. Can I have... Maybe that's enough to kind of make them feel rushed. You're not repeating Silo now. No, no, not at all. JL, got a lot to do. Oh, he still hit Zywu. So a three on three. 35, Magis bringing that bomb in. The top site is theirs. They've gone full round yard in through he heaven. Heard on the ladder is simple. Back into the lobby. So a full roll reversal for the retake. It's the final round. They'll give it all it's worth. The angle from Flames seems destined for glory, especially if Magis can draw attention. Eventually, just like that, Flames collect. Magis goes well. Looks like they'll lead with or leave with the lead. Bit goes down. It's Flames to confirm it. 8-7 on the half. Is there a chance for us to see the third map of this series? It's certainly closer than the first, but Na'Vi, they're going to have to pull up their socks. They need a pistol and they need T-side rounds. Otherwise, elimination. Throw out the smoke. Two towards the roof side. Oh, they blocked each other. <laughs> Fumbled that as well, haven't they? Alexi B is down to half health <laughs> by gravity. Oh, the sixth dear. man for vitality. Flames. Hello. Oh, Ooh. goodbye, Alexi. Adjusts him to him nicely, overwhelming the top site, and that is exactly what Na'Vi needed. A perfect pistol to inject some confidence and some extra rounds to close that gap, take the lead. Overpass. It was the third map of our second series. Been a whole lot of Counter-Strike played today. We have, of course, seen G2 toppling and sending nine packing out of the tournament to one VP. JL would not be running away from the bomb. Did he just think he was kind of playing safe for any funny business and didn't have time to, to get away? I can't explain that. You can't that explain too. that one. Okay.
What is going on with these smoke walls? Imet flexing his golden gun, and it is a one-shot headshot. To the face of the Wu. Only four CTs remaining, and hedging their bets ramp side. Oh, actually, hang on. Sphinx has brought the fight, and now Magis Famas fills the feed as well. Flames is rotating through to support him. Apex going to be baited in. This could actually fall apart for Na'Vi. This would be a real problem. Apex, he's had a quiet game. Two frags, but if his Deagle just gets to the skull of one of them. Oh, crowd clear. Nice from Alexi. Levels it up. And the Famas, not enough. Alexi, huge impact. He's continuing the fin. He's gotten him into the site. Now it's up to Flames. And with a 10 second defuse, he has to move quickly. Oh, 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 oh I think he no. has an idea. Alexi's a one shot body shot. Grabs the rifle, clearing through, considering dark. The first will happen. The second is up for debate. Does he consider the deep clear? Does he consider the deep clear? He might. No, he doesn't. Oh, turn! Oh, he even gets the finger on the trigger. JL clutches up. In flames. Just as that smoke arrives, he'll pep a couple of bullets through the smoke and Molotov down. They leap through. The flash is so good. And now, well, it gets awkward for Sphinx. And bit. He turned away. Nice work from Spix. Only eight bullets back turned onto Alexi. Zyber will collect. And now it's all up. Oh, up to him. Get some both. Team effort. Some big contributions. Some damage inflicted by Apex. And finished off nicely. Oh. Wow. Ime punishes the jump from Zywu. That's the information he was looking for. And now he's rocking the AK. Is there any more to be said about this? Oh, Spink spotted. Eliminated. Apex is low. Yeah. Is there really a clutch here? With 19 seconds, he does have to hurry up and plant. Where's Apex gotten off to? I'm not sure, but Magis, at this point, with the clock like this, it's going to be very difficult for Rimmer to get away with this. Like, you have to plant. Hurry, think. Oh, the vertical bomb. Might be his good luck charm here, Emma. Oh, oh. Faked it. Open for both of them. Magis doesn't move a muscle and still wins the clutch. <laughs> nice attempt. Keeps hold of his weapon. Good, good damage, right? The finances right here are pretty slim. New squad mates get it done. It's going to be a tough battle back here for Vitality. They win this one. I'll spurn us into the next, I mean, 1900. Bit already with a bit of space as I was. He spotted it. Yeah, it doesn't matter. Ime drops down into the jaws of Apex. He'll take that one. Yeah, that works nicely. Zywu, next victim. That's a brilliant find. Double in the feed, favoring Na'Vi. Going to break Vitality here as well. Most definitely, unless Magisk has got more of that. Well, that wasn't bit, simple. But simple, yeah, AWOL. Where did the man go? Flames as well. Oh, Max terrible weapon for the job. Oh, okay. USP back of the head. First bullet. Alexi doesn't know. They don't oh, know. Oh, because oh. of the silencer. Flames with an insane play. Just when it looked like a guarantee. Simple up heaven. And look at his reaction. <laughs> oh, man. They can't even explain it. Alexi B's sitting there trying to explain it. Where was he? Was he secret? Oh, damn. Flames. I am astounded. Let's see that again. Like, watch Alexi B's reaction. Like, well, absence of a reaction. They had no idea. The silencer completely masking his silo flank. Wow. Uh, Simples had to leave his perch here. Oh, he's dead too. Oh, and this the is tilt's a, just yeah. come back in. Full tilt. Full just tilt. as it was starting to look good. Oh, give him another. Oh. Give him another. Oh, Flames, that's a round to be proud of. Recovers for the squad. The new addition gives Vitality 10. That was looking miserable. That was looking absolutely miserable. It started with Emma onto Apex, right. dropping off main, simple surging forward, winning the head-to-head -head against Zywu, who was top of the scoreboard. And then Flamesy manages to make that flank happen. Oh. Oh, wow. Yeah, here's the kill That's on the to Zywu. That's the biggest head-to-head -head in the server right now. Yeah. Magic and he just won it flat big. out. Oh. Completely obscured by the smoke. Weird fourth. But look at the heads up. This is so quick, and he has support here as well. He's not on his own. So quick. Maybe Sphinx has got him in. Oh, good find from him. Wins out the duel, taking the space. You can see knife out, and it does lead to his demise. Magisk was already rotated through. Thought he had a gap, and no longer there. Now, there's no smoke he can throw on top of that, so he will have access upon the end of the incendiary. The bigger issue is if they try and return. Ooh, yeah. Oh, oh. Not just going looking for answers, but they're coming. This is a powerful angle. With simple bait, the barrel, beautiful work. The team, oh, they still go down. Matt just gets them both despite the bait. And now it's another problem for Na'Vi.
Fortunately, Alexi B, oh, he doesn't have a friend anymore. JL's gone, and Alexi B, though he has been performing, he knows where Zywu is. Oh, Zywu gets the information. Does he really get the frag as well? This is Alexi's frag, no! He survives, tucks in, and is caught by flames. Yeah, Teamwork. It's looking like a 2 now. It is, isn't it? Yeah, Na'Vi definitely voiced some concerns right here, but I think we can celebrate the fact that Vitality have come in great form, right? They were able to dispatch that of MIBR in their opening game with ease, and now here against Na'Vi. We'll reiterate once more, map number one in case you missed it. I won't blame you. Yeah, 16 to 2. It happened so quick over the blink of the eye. And yeah, it, simple baiting that. I'm surprised to see them go forward into it, especially knowing it was an org. But I guess when he starts shooting, you think that he's lost control of the spray. I still can't even help you with this one. Just ask Harry and Hugo. Like, this is this is my bread and butter. Losing my cool. But I, I, I can't even help you out here. Yeah, there's no solutions to that one. Magisk, got a lot to deal with there. They have confirmation of his location. Yeah, simple dig in the feed. Oh, and Whoa. JL nails Zywu. The flames consistent as ever. And with Apex's help, they're going to deny at least a round. But the bomb plant goes down. So it's something to be celebrated. Extra funds for Na'Vi, but they're running out of rounds. Yeah, three for Spinks in that one. One for Apex, one for Flamesy. And, uh, well... Delay that. Now, this, setup. this is an interesting setup. I guess in the absence of the knowledge yard, they're, they're just going to stand in this crossfire. What but a it gamble. means that, yeah, it's a huge gamble, but it might be rewarded. Great from Alexi. They're going to overlook Zywu. Quick reaction out a bit. Advantage Navi. Ooh, not for long. JL down and Apex already burrowed into the site. All he has to do is take down one of the two Ukrainians. Simple. Oh! Down. Oh, 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 oh. The bow, the double headshot from Apex. Quiet throughout but an impactful one to twist the knife and get the nail in the coffin of Na'Vi. Humat doesn't have the health for the rest. He's taken down Spinks. We'll need the door to distract and hope he can isolate some jewels. He's trying to do every trick in the book, but they're not going to give him anything with 15 seconds. You've got a plant, mate. You've got to leave there. And with his back turned, he'll be spotted out and fragged up. Apex, yeah. he's going to be happy with that one. That was high impact from the IGL. Bit of a hot hand there. You've got to acknowledge that, right? He has been quiet throughout, sure, but they were just absolute scorchers of shots. I get simple on an AWP, I think, as well. And he stayed calm for the second as well, right? He didn't just do a classic Apex overextend. Like, that was beautiful work. Well, let's watch this one again. Yeah, onto the AWP. Absolute screamer from Apex here. And as you think it, they kill two players over towards ramp. Uh, yeah, it matches and Zywu fall. You think, okay, yeah. well, now they just have to deal with Apex, who's struggling, and he pulls that out of nowhere. Looks very similar to the previous. And him at onto Zywu. No smoke will required if he's just going to take the jewel and win it. Oh, gosh, Flames, you are. Yeah, what, do you, what is your plan here? The incendiary's not bad. Sphinx has lobby. So he can reposition. Tender is Apex great. Has caught one. Look at that. It flushes them into Apex. He could have gotten both there. And Flames, he might be set for some more success. Repositioning nicely. They've tried to clear him out. He's done so much work in it. Facilitate. Oh, no. No. He gets two of the three. Imet opens and closes that round and gives Na'Vi something to celebrate. It's been a while. It has been six from Vitality in a row. And it's Ime in a 1v1 to close. Uh, the mood couldn't have Bro, possibly flames. gotten any more Can we just talk sour? about a whole sequence? Yeah, well, that's the thing. And, and kind of pulling it out on the fly here. That that Molly perfectly placed. Flushed them in towards Apex as well. Magis then comes with out with that. Orc. Oh, wow. <sighs> They're hanging on. They're hanging on. Yard, they used force. See this first yeah. smoke? It's a progression smoke. But then they did the yard. Yeah, I... Well, it's not going to be the end of the world. You can see Alexi. Oh! oh, that's the bomb. That's the bomb. Bit comes down the ladder and Spinks' forward position is rewarded. That was bungee jumping out a bit. He couldn't believe it. That's a jump scare for Bit, I reckon. Down the ladder, suddenly face to face with Spinks. Yeah, man. Bomb on his back. Util dumped. And they're on their way in. Good flashes. Great utility. But they have their vision. And there's a lot of bodies charging. Good from Ima. Still a recovery from Flames. He gets all three. Not the fourth. It's Apex to steal it. And Na'Vi, they are in trouble. 15 in total now for Vitality. Just one more to go. And Na'Vi through, gritting their teeth. This has just been a series that they would want to forget. Sure, the competition has really turned up a notch on Nuke. It looks like they're in touching distance of a competitive match, but... There's been just brilliance from Flamesy, hasn't there? 
I mean, throughout the series, 25 here. I think Mirage was at the top of the scoreboard as well. It is just an incredible performance. Yeah, he had 20. He was 22 and 4, plus 18 on map number one. Yeah, any flamesy pickers are going to be licking their lips. Because Apex, he's gone down to simple, trying something aggressive. So there's the leg up to try and win the first of the four consecutive required to stay in the competition. Out of position right now, Magisk. He is. He'll opt for dark. He's just gotten in there in time. Zai was spotted out. Still takes one. Maybe overlooking Magisk for the first. <gasps> and the second as well. Imma, what was that? Jumps on top of his head. Simple will catch him eventually. Puts us into a two on two. And with everything to play for, can Simple pull Na'Vi into another? JL with him. Arriving for the bomb. It spinks onto JL, meaning it's simple. Up against the world. Does he have the capacity to double swing in? And they take it. Vitality, knock him out into your first semi-finalist. Locked in. These quarterfinals fly by and Vitality flying high. Na'Vi broken after that one. Amazing series here from Flamesy. He showed up in buckets and spades today. 22 on map number one, 26 on map number two. We're talking 48 in total, if I've done my maths right. A huge series from him, but it wasn't just him. This team showed up, every individual with moments to be proud of. And Na'Vi on the other side, the fact that they were able to put something competitive on the board after their own map pick, Mirage, went so, so poorly. 16 to two, absolutely blown out of the server. Sure, they found some fight, they found some smiles, they found some moments, but frustration, that's gonna be the story here for Na'Vi. Yeah, vitality are to be feared. Everyone here at Gamers 8 has taken notice. When you've got Flamesy, you've got Magis, you've got Zywood, you've got Spinks. That's a terrifying group of talent.